Friday night, everybody come to get lit. Red cups, what you sip? My man roller, he bring a zip. Girls, all my niggas call you guys, fall in line, they ain't got no plans, you can tell them to slide. I'm feast the beast, they told you otherwise, them suckers lie. Can't nobody do it like me, I'm seasoned like checker fries, what's the vibe? You know what it is when we come inside, this weather feeling good, looking nice like the summertime. Let's get together, we call it the party of the year. You end up missing this, you gon' be sorry you ain't here. Light skin, long hair, better than Cardi from the red. You got me some good game, yeah, I talk it up in here. This the one, they say they like it, play it back, it got a mic, but I'm excited, never tired. Just I'm that was recorded. Did you you caught that? I did. Welcome back to another episode of Drink Reviews with your favorite alcoholics, down privileged drinkers. Taste testers for the hood. But suburban safe. We do not Unprivileged Drinkers, baby. Align with everything that's said on this show. I just want y'all to know that. But in this episode, we will re- be reviewing Red Stripes. Why? Because yeah, I'm on. a couple of our guys are about to go to Jamaica, so we figured it'd be a great idea. But before we get into that, let me do these introductions. You got your boy Dirt, the dirtiest motherfucker alive. To my left is Dink, a.k.a. Pooty, or Pooty, a.k.a. Dink. And to the far left, we got the, cap- got this, the, people's favorite drink. We got the captain of his own ship. <laughs> captain. I'm privileged. Why you do that? I'm privileged drinker, he wants baby. To he, he likes the attention. Sometimes you let him live with that. Anyway, like I said, uh, oh, behind the, the board, we got our guy, Unk. <laughs> Yo, My what bad. up? <laughs> uh, so, like I said, we're doing the Red Stripes. No Jamaican way. trip coming up. Yeah. Well, not a DJ. DJ Unk, 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 Unk. No. But, DJ, j- 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 not even saying shit like never get it anyway so while we crack these open you guys can talk about your trip to jamaica tell us what y'all about to get into how you're looking forward to it yep but this shit's gonna be ignorant off the hook (laughs) (laughs) i just look i look forward to uh just celebrating you know two of some of my favorite people went in the east the 20 year of our no that's that's why we're going there um, so I look, I look forward to, you know, seeing them, uh, renew their vows and party, drink, eat good food, um, and live life to the fullest, man. That's what it's about. Having a good time with good people that, that, that vibe well. And, um, hopefully we all make it back safe the same way we go there. <laughs> Then nobody do no dumb stuff that I've been seeing on YouTube's and TikToks, man. People want to jump off the top of the damn sliding board and breaking their necks. Let's, let's just keep it. We gonna we gonna get ignorant, but we ain't gonna get dumb. You know what I mean? We gonna try to keep it clean. Well, at least I know I'm not. You know, I, my son will be there. But yeah, I'm just looking forward to having a good time, man. That, that's all. You know what I mean? Continue to live life, live, laugh, love. <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. Like you said, um, it's the big bro. It's just, um twenty year uh, anniversary. They're doing a vow renewal at uh, in Jamaica. Uh, it's the Rio Rio um, Ocho's Reels. Rio Ocho's Reels. That's the name. Of Second it. time going there. Actually, I forgot. To right, because they went. That's why you ain't go. I didn't go that time. That was twenty fourteen oh, or twenty thirteen. Well, same as well, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It was, was it twenty thirteen or twenty fourteen? The ten year. So that'd be twenty thirteen. Yeah. Right. So balcony special, remember? So we're going back to our argument. We're going back <laughs> to the uh, resort um, to, like I said, celebrate their twenty year anniversary. Uh, we do. I, I do expect to have a great time. I'm probably going to be limited to how much fun I have. My little children are coming with me, so I probably won't have as much fun as people who got. Eh, I'm not, you know, it's not my twist, but you know, she gonna she gonna pack something and something and make you get it in there some kind of. She she gonna sneak it some kind of way for you to eat it, smoke it, or drink it. So yeah, we celebrating the twenty year anniversary. The back fuck. to you, Dirt. <laughs> the fuck. Well, let's get back into these beers, I guess. Red Stripe is like a the go to beer for Jamaicans and Jamaica. Um, personally, I've never really been a big fan of Red Stripe, but you know, I'm gonna drink them, rate them one through ten. Tap your drinks, yeah, fellas. Come on. Boy, I agree. Shut up. It's 
Something I recently heard about Red Stripe The alcohol percentage is higher in Jamaica I didn't know that I just, I, I just learned that like last week or two weeks ago I honestly think that's why I like them better in Jamaica And I was about to say the same thing They taste better in Jamaica Like It's like almost a different beer Yeah I think these are bottled in somewhere in New York or something Jamaica Queens which is hilarious Yeah well no, there you have it It almost has like a Malt liquor taste At the end I mean, You end, would be right? our malt liquor expert huh? <laughs> You would know Well yeah being a connoisseur of any mains to 11s he said it. He said it. He said it. He said it. Ballers and blast. That's crazy to call no, it. No, at the end, the end it, it, don't forget your four locos. Four crazy niggas. Well, you had a four loco, man. But um, I mean, I guess I can rate this. Uh, excuse mm, me. Guess that's what we're doing. It barely passes. I give a six point five. I give a six point five. I wish it was colder. Um, I didn't know about you know. <laughs> I do. I didn't. I didn't like the tail end of it. Okay. Yeah, that's where I'm, that's where it, some that's where the malt liquor pilot, is. It's giving off of a malt liquor taste at the very end. But that's why I had to give it a six point five. Um, but I went. Oh, besides the fact, I, I wish it was colder. Yeah, I didn't know it was uh the, the uh, red stripes in Jamaica and higher alcohol percentage. What's what is it? Yeah, we, I, I, I actually Plus, don't this know. This is a four we point seven. That. that has to be like a six point. It probably is like north of six. Like, I'm not one hundred percent sure. Uh, well, I give it a six point five. Um, it definitely tastes. I'm a, I'm a, I I really never noticed the difference between the red stripes in Jamaica versus the ones that are here in America. No. Um, I never really paid any mind, but I will be paying. Much attention to it this go around because of how you said it's this bottle different, made in different. Like uh, the one in America is made in New York and Jamaica is uh, the yeah. red stripe in Jamaica. Of course, is made somewhere in Jamaica. I'm assuming. Yeah, um, Kingston. Kingston. Yeah, right. It is Kingston with a higher alcohol percentage. So I'm, I'm gonna be looking out. I'm gonna look forward to trying that and uh, trying to differentiate the two. Um, means that that's maybe about less. That's less than a week away now. So yeah, six point five from the cap. Um. Uh, I'm not really happy with this, um, but like y'all said, I do I do drink them more. Well, I mean, I only been in Jamaica once, but um, when I was there, I remember us getting a bunch of like red stripes, mm-hmm. specifically when we was trying to watch the Sixers game in Europe. <laughs> We had a bunch of beer. We had some. Do you know whiskey. who I am? <laughs> we had some whiskey, and we had 12, 12 oh, wings shit. between like twenty five feet. Oh, I made that phone oh. call. Yeah, and you, 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 but you were talking about that phone call. Yeah. You made like four phone calls. <laughs> we, we were trying to get the food, right? Yeah, yeah. like yeah. yo, I'm one of the funny, shit, one of the funniest days. Buddy came to the room like, yeah, whatever you just order, it. I'll bring it right back up. <laughs> and then you said, yeah, the guy said he'll bring it right back up to us. So let's like, just put the order in. <laughs> Oh really? This thing got in trouble. <laughs> we never got our food. We made the call and start threatening people and shit. They brought us fifteen hot beers and double shots. Yep. Of, uh, of Appleton. A whole bunch of shit. Was it on the table. I thought it was. It was. Uh, I, thought, I think it was Appleton. And no food though. Like we had twelve wings. I thought it was Johnny Walker, the red one. It was one of the two. Oh, I don't shit. remember which think, one it was. I, I think it was Johnny Walker, the red, the red one. Sure hope I'm running that brother on the way back to Jamaica. But uh, too far. Yeah, you sure are far away. But um, yeah, I, I um, uh, I'll give I, I might agree with Cap. I might get this a six. So, so I said six point five. So it barely made it. All right. Well, yeah. Well, I'm giving it a six. That's not approved. Right. I'm still- I'm giving it a four and a half. If you have not. Drink a red stripe. You do not have to drink a red stripe. Again, if you're a drinker of sorts and you haven't tried it, give it a try. But make sure you go to Jamaica to try the one there too. That's the only reason I would say you should drink this one. If not, yeah, just just to be able to tell the difference, like because it really is a, a difference in the two. Like in Jamaica, it was like second nature to get a red stripe. Now I won't even look at them. So. That's true. I, yeah. And I think it it tastes pretty light for a lager. And oh, one hundred percent. It tastes like a light beer for over. Yeah, it's it watered like, down. Yeah, it did. Well, yeah, it tastes yeah. watered down. Yep. And ain't it chief. So four and a half. I'm finished though. 
That's that's my Definitely number. You know what I mean? Um, I I think I would give it like about a six as well. Um, I've said this for years that I think the the red stripe in Jamaica is like just better tasting. I don't know. It's just, like I said, it's light. It tastes like it's more full flavored there. I don't know. It could just it be like red stripe light. That's what this is. Right. It could just be like maybe we there use in a in a vibe or it, I don't know, but. It, uh, it's a difference. It definitely is a vibe. Yeah, yeah. So, um, <laughs> but this is a uh, yeah. I'll give it a six. I'm not. I'm not the biggest fan of. But again, of course, I'm going to finish it. I got no choice. Yes, sir. What if it was colder, if it was colder, I definitely think I would enjoy it a little bit more too. Because this is like me. It's a little above room temperature. To, it seemed like. Yeah, it I, honestly, to honestly, any beer a little colder does taste better. Absolutely, like any beer fresh out yeah, the freezer. Four to four like, my four and a half will go to a five. It's that. It's that right before it freezes, like literally right uh-huh. before it freezes. When you get that motherfucker, you crack it, and you just see this. That, I recently had a conversation with a uh, That's one of my old heads at work, and we was talking about like different beers and things like that. Mm-hmm. I said, "There's nothing like it." Like when I was younger, after like a a game of five on five or something like that, where you like you playing real hard, Gatorade was the go to. Mm-hmm. As I started drinking beer, it was like. Shit, I'll take a cold beer over a Gatorade after a run any day of the fucking week. Now, I don't know if that makes me an alcoholic, but if it does, just, I'm glad you're here watching me. <laughs> I mean, last time I remember running, well, I think I watched when y'all was playing in, at King High School. Uh, I think that was the last time I played. Yeah, I think right before y'all went in, y'all had something to drink, or right after. It was probably right after because okay. we couldn't bring it inside. So. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know yeah, it wasn't I inside. Was, I think it was inside. It might it have been some in somebody's car. Floating yeah. around somewhere. After. Yeah, right. yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, and so sounds like to me it doesn't get the unprivileged stamp. Sorry to tell you, fuck red stripe. Well, red stripe. Fuck red stripe. There's always that. There's always that. Man. And I said it. I, I said I it. Partially enjoyed it. Of course you did. Well. Anyway, that was another drink review with the Unprivileged Drinkers, your favorite alcoholics. Um, check us out on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, Twitter. It's just missing some yeast or something. There. Anywhere that you listen to podcasts, anywhere that you can watch content, we are there. Pornhub. I was about to say. Almost. Only, al- only, almost, only fans. Almost, <laughs> almost anywhere. <laughs> um, and remember, if all you're drinking these, just look up. XX.